Hi and welcome to this Surface Pro or tutorial where I'll be showing you how to fix up app scaling for your apps. Now if you're not sure what I'm talking about, let's fire up Photoshop and as you can see from the onset the loading screen is tiny and now in the application everything else is incredibly tiny um, like so. So to fix problems like that which can also happen with VLC Media Player, Microsoft Word, of, uh, Microsoft Office, and a whole abundance of programs. Um, the first thing you want to do is download this registry file with the link in the description box down below. If you don't trust it, right click, edit, and you'll see that it only adds one key to the registry. And that key tells uh, Windows to prefer external app scaling settings um, which will be administered through a file which I will go into more detail about later so download that double click and click yes to add that uh, to your computer and once you've done that you want to go back to that description box and download this the program.manifest file which is basically a text document saved as a dot manifest um, I'll open it up it's just a bunch of text that tell th this is the external app scaling setting, right? And this will tell Windows um, to basically view the application as you normally would, so everything is the correct size. So once you've downloaded that, uh, go to the program directory of the app that you want to fix the scaling of. So for me, that's Photoshop. Um, so that is in computer, C, program files, Adobe, Adobe Photoshop CC 2014. And you want to find the executable that actually runs the program. So Photoshop, that is this, photoshop.exe. So what you want to do now is go to that program.manifest file, make a copy of it so that you can keep it in case you have more programs that you want to fix. And you want to rename program to the name of the programs executable. So for me, I would have to rename it to photoshop.exe.manifest. And I've already prepared that here. So a renamed version that has photoshop.exe.manifest. And once you've renamed it, you want to move that into the program directory of the program. Right, so now that that's in there, let's go ahead and fire up Photoshop. And you can tell straight away that the loading screen is the proper size and we're in and everything is uh, sized appropriately, which is perfect. I can now do whatever it is I need to do um, without the hassle of squinting to look at those tiny little toolbars. So that's all there is to it. Um, in my experience, this also works for VLC Media Player, Microsoft Office, a whole range of programs. If this works for you, don't forget to drop a subscription, like my video, and share your thoughts in the comments below.